Welcome back to the Pokemon Black Dangan Lock. So, now we are here for the official start of the lock. And, um, yeah, I received, um, uh, uh, well, one comment in particular from, uh, Jerry Stuff Rowe, which, or Rowe, which, by the way, he's a really good friend of mine. <laughs> uh, and he's, um, um, just... Well, he's just a cool person in general. Uh, I'll probably leave a link in the description below to his channel. So, uh, yeah. Um, so, he selected that we should start our uh, adventure. Uh, well, first of all, let's get our stuff sorted. So, he suggested that we start our adventure with um, Leon and Ishimaru. So, yeah, there's that. Um, uh, no, don't do that. Uh, so I'm gonna put you here. Uh, you know what I should do? What I should do now is, uh, what I'm gonna do is, uh, let's turn off cheats now. Or it's, actually, we can just press disable. So. So yeah, and uh, one last thing here, if I do this, that, yada, yada, yada. Okay, we should be good. Alright, so, uh, nope, I didn't take out the Lucario. So, we both, we have uh, special attacker, oh, d special attackers? Uh, we have uh, both physical attackers now, which is kind of a yikes. So, <laughs> I'm personally not sure how I'm going to be able to get through this. But, uh, we'll try somehow. And, uh... Yeah, if you guys remember in the last episode, we kind of went through a bit of stuff. <laughs> um, but just going over the rules. So yeah, um, I gotta remember to turn the the uh, the tech speed like super high. Uh, nope, don't do that. Okay, come on then. Alright, so that's gonna be six. Alright. Now what I'm gonna do... Okay, I'm so used to using a Nintendo Switch controller to the point where I'm, I always think... Yeah, it's been a while since I've played with this controller. It's been a while since I've played with that. With this one. So... So, yeah. At least I remember where the B button is. Okay, anyways. We're making our way, um, and, uh, yeah, I guess we gotta come check this out, huh? Yep, damn it, okay. Okay, Brandon, come check, come here a sec. Come here a sec, okay. Ooh. Alright then. Okay. My name is Monokuma! <laughs> okay, alright, enough of the jokes. My name is Getsis. I am here representing Team Plasma. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. I'm sure most of you believe that we humans and Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and need each other. However, is that really the truth? Have you considered that perhaps we humans only assume this is the truth? Pokemon are subject to the selfish commands of trainers. They get pushed around when they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in what I'm saying? Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain unknown potential. They are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. Tell me, what is our responsibility toward these wonderful beings called Pokemon? That's right, we must liberate the Pokémon. 
Then, and only then, will humans and Pokemon truly be equals. Everyone, I end my words here today by imploring you to consider the relationship between people and Pokemon and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. Alright, that's that. But obviously, as a person who likes stuff, I don't want that to happen. And we just started on our adventure too. Yeah. Alright then. Oh golly, it's N. Oh no. Your Pokemon. Just now I was saying. Slow down, you talk too fast. And what's this about Pokemon talking? That's an odd thing to say. Yes, they're talking. Oh, then you two can't hear it either. How sad. My name is N. My name is Charon, and this is Brandon. We were asked to complete the Pokedex. Actually, we were actually supposed to save the world from Monokuma, so I think that's what we're actually supposed to be doing. And we just left on our journey. My go my main goal is to become the champion, though. The Pokedex, eh? So, you're going to confine many, many Pokemon in Pokeballs for that, then. I'm a trainer, too, but I can't help wondering. Are Pokemon really happy that way? Well, Brandon, is it? Let me hear your Pokemon's voice again. Oh no! Um. Okay, one second. I wanna see if I can do this. Oh my gosh! Okay. We should be okay in this scenario at least. Um, I wanna set up a Dragon Ants. Okay. Double team? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. I don't know if I want you to do that. I wanna just straight up go for the Flare Blitz. This should kill you, right? It's so painfully slow. I'm so sorry. Okay. Alright, as long as Pokemon are confined in Pokeballs, Pokemon will never become perfect beings. I have to change the world for Pokemon, because they're my friends. Huh, strange guy. But I'm not going to worry about it. Traders and Pokemon help each other out. Listen, I'm going on ahead. I want to battle the gym leader in the next town, Strides and City. Aim to battle a gym leader after gym leader. The best way for a trainer to become stronger is to challenge the gym leaders in each area. Alright then. <laughs> I love how I just ended it right there and then. Okay. Um. Well, that just happened. Huh. I wonder if this is the right way I'm supposed to be going, so... Like, if this is the right approach, I'm not sure. Okay. I love this, honestly. Okay, now we get a phone call here. X transceiver! I know these games all too well, I'm sorry. Okay. Brandon, it's your mom. How are things? Are you and your Pokemon getting along and enjoying your journey so far? I need to talk to you, so I called, but I'm going to hang up the X transceiver now. She like ran up, ran past here. Okay, what's up? Finally caught up with you. And look how far you've come. Professor Juniper said that you were probably headed for Strides and City by now. I have another present for you. Try these on. These are honestly really going to help a lot. Alright. Okay. Alright, so... Um, yeah. So, we're not catching any Pokemon here. Wow, that's a 
That's a dust clop, so. Yeah, I gotta see something. Give me one second. Okay, so I spent like 10 minutes, uh, like trying to figure out like ways to like make this faster, and um, yeah, this is the best that I can do. <laughs> um, hopefully it runs a little faster, but I have no idea really. Uh, anyways, we're gonna take down this dust clops hopefully. Nightshade. Okay. We should have no problem. <laughs> Yo, imagine if we lost Leon there just now. That would have been insane. That honestly would have been insane. I would have lost my mind. I would have genuinely lost my mind. Yo, we almost up another level. Kind of crazy. Um, yeah, I think it's running pretty okay now. Sort of. Okay, what if I made the window smaller? So if I did this... Oh, I can't even make it smaller. Whoops. Um, and I messed up the I messed up the layout too. No. Okay, hold up. Okay, I'm back. I'm not gonna do that again, or so I hope. Uh, anyways, um, uh, let's go back to like the route that we were at. Um, and uh, yeah, let's get some things going here. <clears throat> Goodness. Um, I need to drink some water, don't I? Okay. So anyways, uh, wow, I was gonna, I was gonna pick up the item there, okay? Oh, there's a yaw mask, okay. Alright, hi yaw mask. Say hello to my little friend. Oh, okay, never mind, I guess not. I guess not, huh? Jeez, double protect? Hello? How do you get, fam? All right. Well, we got a problem here. <laughs> we got a problem here. We got a problem. So, my Pokemon are not gonna listen to me. Which is a big problem. How is this thing getting so many protects? I need to know. Well, I guess that's gonna be very detrimental. That's actually gonna be a big problem. I got an expert belt on the other hand. Okay, so this probably means I can't level up uh, Lucario that high either. Huh. Oh, I have to fight my rivals too, that's true. Oh no, okay. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Okay. I'm surprised that it's running like super fast suddenly. Alright. Hoot hoot. Oh no. Okay. Okay, hoot hoot. Um, prepare to meet your maker. <laughs> Come on then. Please. Please do it. Yes! Okay. Thank you so much. But golly, this Charmander is listen is not listening to me way too early. God, that sounds familiar. If you guys if you guys watch the Pokemon anime, then you would know. But if you haven't, well then tough luck. Okay, I don't really want to fight you, so that's good. Oh my god. Oh, it's a Tyrogue. Okay. All right. What the heck? No, we're not running into this thing right now. Let's not fight you. Let's not fight you. Oh my god. Let's not fight you. Golly, you are a terrifying being. Oh my god, stop. <gasps> There's a Gengar! Okay. Hey, you know what? That's gonna be, that's gonna be um that's gonna be Junko if we ever get her. That's gonna be Junko if we ever get uh to use her. So yeah, we got two items here. We got a Pokey doll that allows us to run. Okay. Okay, and a sticky barb. I'm not sure how useful that's gonna be. Actually, speaking of useful, 
Um, I like how it's running uh, fast now. Um, we should probably give this to Ishimaru. This does seem like the type of item that Sakura would use, though. Okay, anyways. Now, we have to fight our rival, which is... Scary! Oh no, okay. She should only have two Pokemon here, right? Oh no. Okay, Bianca, what have you got? You've got a Pidgey! Yo. What is this? Like, freaking, what is it? What is this? What has this become? What has this become? Oh no, okay, if you keep doing that, that's gonna be a problem. Come on then. Oh no, oh no. Yeah, this is gonna be a huge issue. Okay, good, you Flare Blitzed. Sweet. Sweet. Meowth. Okay. Um. Do I let Ishimaru take care of this? I'm gonna stick with uh, Leon for now. Okay, this little one's up next. Okay, alright. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try a Metal Claw. Alright, listen. Listen. Leon. I know, I know you were a killer in uh, a Trigger Happy Havoc, but... Seriously, that's not the time. Okay, alright. Um, you know what I want to do? Just so I can preserve my medicine, I have to, I have to, like, use Ishimaru. I have got to use Ishimaru, otherwise this will not work. This will genuinely not work. Um, I'm gonna use Dark Pulse, that way it doesn't affect my attack. I use my special attack instead, which kills off a uh, Meowth, which is good. Because apparently, uh, Danganronpa students are really good at killing for some reason. Unless we find them out. Which we usually do. Um, but yeah, I'm a little terrified. There's supposed to be an item here. Electorizer! Too bad we're not using, um... Wait, one second. Why did I buy Pokeballs at the start? I'm so used to- man. I am so used to the the regular Nuzlocke uh, type of thing that I have completely forgot I should not be using Pokeballs. It's gonna be a huge problem with me, isn't it? It's gonna be a huge problem with me, isn't it? I have to like solely focus on like um, uh, potions. Like I have to solely focus on medicine. And there's probably like, like 10 of you guys like watching and you're just like slamming your face against the keyboard. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't even know my own rules, okay? <laughs> oh my god, okay. Alright, but anyways, um... Yeah, this entire debacle is gonna be a problem, so... Pokemon uh, Trainer School here. Uh, let's head in. And uh, we gotta battle our other rival. And, uh, he's going to, uh, use, uh, this thing. So he has two Pokemon too, correct? I'm a little nervous as to what he's gonna have. Slackoth, okay. This is gonna be a problem. If I do if... Leon doesn't listen. Oh my god! Fam! We're both loafing around, have you noticed? Okay. Encore? What? Can you, like, not attack me? Come on, then. Oh my god. Okay, good. Sweet. Yeah. Okay, yo, Leon actually packs power. Only downside is that- <laughs> there's a wingle. The only downside is that Leon just won't listen. So, yeah, that's a big problem. Um, I'm gonna Dark Pulse because that hits uh, Wingle hardest, I believe. 
Oh my god. Come on then, come on then, come on then. Yo, it's honestly been a minute since I played uh, Pokemon Black. It's my first, um, this is actually my first Pokemon game as well. And that also stems me to, oh fuck, we're level 11. That also stemmed me to ask, like, where are all the other Pokemon in, like, the past generations? Until I look back a few years later, I'm like, oh wait, they didn't exist yet. So, yeah, there's that. Okay. Ooh, thanks for the orange berries, by the way. They're actually really gonna help. Okay. So, I have to give this to... Leon. So we can't use more than two Pokemon. Right now, at least. I just changed the rule just because. I got tired. And stuff. Oh, they're silent. Okay. We're gonna take on the gym right now. Honestly, I just want to take on the gym. I'm, like, super anxious as to what's gonna happen. But, um, yeah. Whatever happens, happens, I guess. Okay, I gotta move this aside here. There we go. Okay. Yes. Yes, I am a, I am a gym leader of this town. You are? Right, you want to challenge the gym. In that case, what was the first Pokemon you chose? Oshawa. I see. It's weak against Grass-type Pokemon. I think you need to prepare to face that type. For example, try training your Pokemon in the Dream Yard. Please excuse me now. Well, we can't train because my Pokemon won't listen. So, my best, my best like thing to do now is go into the gym because they're not gonna listen. <laughs> I gotta exercise the mind. Later, later they'll they'll learn to listen. Later they'll they'll learn to listen to their headmaster. Um, but I don't know. Oh golly. Okay, we have to battle someone, and I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so unbelievably nervous. Remoraid. Level 12. Holy. Oh no. Why'd the levels like suddenly spike? This is actually unbelievably scary. What the heck? He's locking onto me. I don't know what you're using. Oh no. Yo, Ishimaru, please listen. Oh no. Oh, why'd you hit yourself? Oh my god! Dude, this- this- this episode's a train wreck. This episode's actually a train wreck. Okay, good, Force Palm. Sweet. Oh my god. Dude, I do not like this. Okay, Bullet Punch. Jiminy Christmas! You guys are gonna give me a heart attack if you keep doing this. You guys are actually gonna keep- you're, you guys are actually gonna give me a heart attack. Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright. This is unbelievably terrifying. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Bro, I have to keep going in and out of the Pokemon Center. Like, just so I can, like... Because the thing is, like... <laughs> I, I really want to be that guy and turn on like a cheat code where they'll just well they'll just listen to me but you know what I'm not gonna do that because I don't want to I really don't want to so anyways okay all right so oh dear lord the specialty of strides in city gym is the full course thing uh, oh god, two Pokemon. Okay, your first Pokemon's a Hoppip. Bless, actually bless. Yo, I honestly don't like water types right now. Yo, please don't tell me you actually have a move that can hit me. Oh god, you have a move that can hit me. Come on then. Come on then. This is like literally the worst time to be turning away. Okay, good. All right, level 14. Clink, okay. You know what I wanna actually do is I wanna switch out uh, Leon 
so he can gain more experience because the thing is he's even though like Leon's still like because he's max IVs but he's only a Charmander um Ishimaru's bulk on the other hand is like much better compared to um uh Charmander or Leon so I kind of want to steer him clear of like like easy hits so yeah I'm super nervous I am not ready for this I'm actually not ready but I guess we gotta go back one more time yeah I imagine watching this gameplay is probably super painful for some of you guys because it's like so damn laggy well the thing is at times it lags too what the heck Okay. Alright. Now let's actually take on the gym leader, and this is gonna terrify me to no end. I'm just saying. Let's do this. Welcome to the Strides and City Pokemon Gym. I'm Chili. I light things up with fire type Pokemon. I'm a water type specialist, and my name is Cress. Pleased to make your acquaintance. And my name is Silen. I like grass type Pokemon. Um, you see, as for why the three of us um, are all here is, well... Oh, enough! Listen up! The three of us will decide whom you'll battle. It'll be based on the type of the first Pokemon you chose. That is indeed the case. And the partner you first chose was water type, it seems. Actually, it happens to be fire, but okay. Nothing personal. No hard feelings. My, Me and my grass type Pokemon will, um... We're gonna battle. Come up, May. So silence seems very, um... Uncertain. I don't know what it is, but okay. I'm so not ready! <laughs> I'm not ready. Electric. Okay. Okay, what are you going to have exactly? Um, I want to uh, I'm going to try this. Okay, we get a huge hit off. We get a huge hit off. How much does this do? Come on then. Ooh, it just straight up kills. That's huge. That's actually huge. That's actually humongous. Quite humongous for us, in fact. You have a Nuzleaf. Yo, we can do this. Hey, you know what? I'm not as worried now. <laughs> I'm not as worried now. Okay, do you have two Pokemon or three Pokemon? I didn't pay attention. Oh, it's one Pokemon. Okay, sweet. Okay, Force Palm. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Ishimaru. Come on, Ishimaru. Oh my god. This is literally the worst time to not notice. This is literally the worst time to pretend not to notice. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Force Palm, yes! Okay, how much does this do? Ooh, that's a decent damage. Do you think we can get another hit off like that? Ah, my Pokemon. Oh no. Oh, he's just used Pound. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Oh my god. Bro, that entire thing was just such a struggle. That entire thing was such a struggle. Honestly, that was just such a struggle. Oh my gosh. Bro, we just got like three levels from that? That's crazy. Faint? Um, no thanks. No thanks on faint. Whew! Bro. Yo, first episode. First actual episode, and we already completed this. What a surprise. You are very strong. Seems like not even Chili or Cress could beat you. We got um, the basic badge, I believe it's called. It's been it's been a minute. It really has been a minute. I really do think it's the basic badge. I think. Nope, that's uh, that's uh, the normal type uh, gem. Trio badge. There we go. All right. We got double. Oh my god, there's no way that we're gonna be able to be using that. Alright, so, um, yeah, that entire thing happened, and we can add two new Pokemon now, so, um, oh yeah, we have to talk to Fennel, obviously. 
Um, oh my goodness. But uh, yeah, honestly, I have no idea who I'm going to be uh, adding to the squad. Uh, I do need something that's going to be able to handle like water types. So <laughs> we got cut. Thanks. Um, is that a PC that I can use? Is that a PC that I can use? Okay. Sweet. So. Now. I really uh, focus right now. Who do we add to the squad? Um. Yo. My selection of Pokemon sucked. Oh my god. Um. Hmm. Personally, I think Sayaka is going to be a good shout. Sayaka might be a good shout. Um, but, okay. What's another thing that I struggle with? Fighting types. I struggle with fighting types a lot, so... You know what? We might as well, um... Actually... Because Junko really can't do much, like, on her own. But on the other hand... Uh, Celesti can do quite a lot. And then we have Biakuya. Oh, I'm not sure. And then we have Espeon, who just brings pure power, but doesn't have, like, moves right now. I'm gonna take, uh, Celesti. I'm gonna take Celesti. I'm gonna take Celesti with me. I'm gonna take the European, uh, student. Even though she's still Japanese, but still. Okay. Anyways, so I'm gonna wrap up today's episode right here. Oh my goodness. That was a lot that we just went through. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to share your support, hit that like button down below for me. Give me a thumbs up. I don't really care. But if you do, subscribe because it really helps on my channel. I'm gonna get the heck out of here. See you guys in the next video. Peace!